card's awesome. I can play Flash. I can play... Yeah, what was it? I can play something as though I had Flash. Maybe I actually couldn't have been so long. Uh, but, like... <laughs> no, you had the uh, Silver Man. Or the... Shimmer Mirror. Shimmer Mirror, that's the one. I may cast Artifacts. I, I think... Hang on a second. I think I actually did something completely illegal. Yeah, I think I cast Reshape as an instant. I shouldn't even have gotten that far. Might be. Because it was like... Or were you playing it off my thing? Yeah, you were playing... You were going to force me to discard. So I actually reshaped as an instant. Wrong of me. All right. So you won it even earlier. If it's, any, if it's worth anything. No, the but, only uh, thing I really did to fuck with you was the Sazat's will. Yeah, and that's why I reshaped. No, you fought your... You fought the mirror. Oh, yeah, that wasn't it reshaping. Yeah, no. Yeah, okay, never mind, never mind. you're good. That was the activated ability. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna have it bite the thing. But I'm gonna copy the ability. <laughs> and it's gonna fight it twice. <laughs> I mean, hey, if it's like a 2-5. Might have to. Yeah. I lost. I go first. There you go. I was talking to Alex, uh, I'm a member of the Facebook group. Okay, I waste time on Facebook. And uh, there's a group that's like, ask a judge, so it's just ask questions about magic. People do not understand improvise with regards to treasure. Yeah. Uh, and you're a little early. And that's by this hand. So, like, I want to do, you know, if, if anyone remembers movie theater, they used to have, like, movie trivia. And it'll just show you an image and be like, who was, I don't know, some, what's some trivia? And then it'll give you a bit to think and then show you the answer. So I'd love to do all manner of, like, magic trivia. You have three mountains, three treasures. Sahili's Directive costs X and three red. Uh, and has Improvise. What's the maximum X you can have? The answer is three. Because you can either improvise with the treasures or tap sack them, but you can't do both, which is apparently a difficult concept for people. Freaking, uh... That's fine. One of the last times we went to go see, I actually think it was the uh, Starship Troopers, but we went to go see the, the Rift Tracks live. Mm. Uh, and, like, they did those, like, made-up behind-the-scene things, you know? Right. And it was about the movie A Thousand Ways to Die in the West, which was a... Seth MacFarlane movie mm. and one of the guys was like wait you mean he's actually in it <laughs> don't worry play snappy Not worried. Flashback you now. This is only six cards here. We're doing. What you? Okay. First I pitch that. Then I'll pitch that. We'll see how this goes. Okay. Pitch a mystical tutor and a dark seal forge. Should I cut mystical tutor? Like what? Inc I have instant sorcerers that are like reshape, which are then what you want to find. Mm -hmm. I buy back naturally. I have counter Vandal spell. Blast, counter spell. But maybe I'm just afraid to hold on to a card all game. Maybe I shouldn't be. Okay. Again, I, I usually only tutor if I can play the card that I'm looking for that turn. Yeah, but do oh. you keep a tutor in your opening hand if you have, you know, if it's a. Mm -hmm. Well, that's fine. You can yeah, win this and tell me, tell me so. In the meantime, more I play. Times, like, sorry. More times out of not, I'll just go look for the Factor Fiction because it shows me five other cards. True. Wow, really, deck? 
Um, Swamp, and it's your turn. Yes! Mountain! Taunos! Swing with Taunos! I take a damage. Hell yeah, then it's a go. Two mana haste, Commander. I recommend it. It's Man, I like... Forest. <laughs> and it's your turn. I want more people to show up and ask for advice, because I keep thinking of more. And my advice? Two mana Commander with haste. <laughs> I'm sure there are several. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. Hey man, I'm... I'm, you know me and my mono redness? Yeah. And how the Lannery Storm has a 2-2 two, two haste for three that gets you a treasure? <laughs> Love that. And then Mountain. there's the other one that just gets bigger whenever you exile a card off the top of your library. Oh, wait. Let's go in this order? Why not? Silvermere. Not Shimmermere. Silvermere. But the one that taps for two. Or a uh, blue, rather. Uh, Taunus. Uh, take one. And then I'll take A reliquary tower. Because of the Kadama's Reach. Nice. What do I have in my hand? So I go look for a swamp into play tapped. Yo, get off the bottom of my library, bro. Swamp into play tapped. And a swamp into my hand. And it's your turn. Not a bad card. Mountain. I'm not playing that one because instead I'll be playing a Spark Double. As a Taunus. Might as well. Dope. That way it has haste. I'll swing with them both. <laughs> I take three. Hell yeah. One of which. Commander Dan. And so go. Think of all the copying artifact abilities I can do. And if I make them artifacts... I play a forest. I should be able to copy his copy. Which will then allow me to copy twice. So. Yeah. So unless, unless I go in a line, I get three total. Okay. Shadow Paint. Also, I forgot to mark my own. Cast for each of us. And it's your turn. And return top. Wait. Top. No. Draw. It's like, when, when did you play it? <laughs> top and copy the activated ability. All right. For somehow mm, three times as much mana. Uh, here's something that I should probably cut. Uh, but first, mountain. Um, and then... Metal Worker. I can tap him, reveal any number of artifact cards in my hand, and add that much colorless. Oh, cool. Uh, so, Hellbent Adam can reveal all the artifacts all, in his hand. All <laughs> none of the cards in his hand, yeah. Yeah. Um, and you got a 3-3 three, three, to Toski. Chatterfang. Chatterfang, yeah. Not Toast. God damn it. No, continuously uh, not Toski. Yeah. Go ahead. Swamp into a very, very excited Skyclave Relic. Nice. Kit. Two copies into play tapped, which gets me two squirrels. If one or more tokens. If one or more tokens would be created under your control, those tokens plus that many one one oh, squirrels. Oh, plus that many. Okay. Yeah. Um, swing with a Chatterfang. I got two four. Yeah, we just bounce off of each other. Yep. That's fine. Your turn. Take this turn, hell yeah. Draw. Earth's Tower! Tap for a colorless. If I can find all three, it's great. But if not, it's a land. Whatever. How many times do I get... Still taps from... for a colorless. Yeah. Dude, yeah, like, 
A lot of, in this game, I swear to God, they're like, oh man, being from Black Meadow must be hard. Um, <laughs> or bored. Yeah. Yeah. As they, yeah, they make a card that makes every land tap for black. I will tap this metal worker, reveal this trading post to float a colorless. Ooh. I will pay three mana to pay trading post. What? Weird. When'd you get that? <laughs> right. I didn't know you had one of those. Yeah. Um. Let's see. Let's try this out. One, tap, sack an artifact, and then I got this Taunos. I'll tap the real one to copy it. Draw a card. Copy it for another. Cool. Hell yeah. And I've left myself a um, man. Worst things have happened. Not this turn, but worst things. And it's a go. Time for my favorite play in this deck. Do you know what it is? No. It's the Verdant Mastery! Uh, I may pay three and a green rather than the spell's mana cost. Search my library for up to four basic land cards, reveal them, put one of them onto the battlefield under an opponent's control <laughs> if the four, three and a green cost was paid. Two of them onto the battlefield tapped under my control, and then the rest into my hand. Fair. So I'm going to get myself a forest and a swamp. You, my good sir, kind, kind sir. Oh, I've got something in my hand. I can have a forest. Oh, thanks. Gotcha, buddy. Tapped. Yep. Okay. Let's put that over here with my colorless. <laughs> That's what's favorite. Is that the only one you have that gives me a forest? Yeah. That makes sense. <laughs> how many of those, how many cards would you do? <laughs> the issue is that it gets me two lands, which is why I play it. Yeah. Uh, and then I play a swamp for the turn. That's fine. Um, six mana left up A. I use two of it for a Golgari Signet. One, two, three. Do you mind leaving three up? No, okay. Um, cool. I swing with a Chatterfang. Um, I got two, four. Right, I can't play it anyways. Uh, I swing with a Chatterfang. You have a forest. Oh, that's right. <laughs> good, good. So, uh, the dumbest play of all time. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Take the turn. Draw the card. Play his own land. Okay. Um. Okay. Well, I'm about to change your priorities slowly. Uh -huh. I'm going to. One, two, three, and a blue. Arkham Dagson. He needs a rail print. I can tap him, target artifact creatures, control and sacrifices. That player may search library for a non-creature artifact card and put it onto the battlefield. That shuffle. He does not have haste, but oh boy. He's a 2-2? Two, two. Yep. And he is not an artifact? That's right. Okay. Um... One, two, Iron Mirror. Mm. Problem is, I kind of want to draw an artifact, but. One, tap, sack an artifact. How about the brand new Iron Mirror? 
No, if anyone asks, the one was this silver mirror. Mm -hmm. Sex iron mirror. Copy it with the real Tonos. Draw two cards. It's like the most cards I've ever seen you draw that I haven't made you draw. <laughs> right? Uh, move to combat. Swing with a spark double. I block it with a 1 1 squirrel. Okay. Pay a black to sack both of my squirrels to kill your yak. Okay. Yeah. Like I said, reorganizing your priorities. Yeah. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. No, that was definitely going to make me get rid of all the creatures in my hand. <laughs> yeah. Play. However, I know you're really excited about it because I'm really excited about it. So it's a Phyrexian around first. <laughs> that was good. That was good. One, two, three. Old knob bone. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Sweet, sweet. I'm going to swing for three. Uh, I have a forest of three. It gets me three treasures. Which gets me three squirrels. <laughs> yep. He's gross. Pretty gross. And it's your turn. The audacity. Yep. Indeed. Uh, is land? Makes me wonder if Old Knob Bone is like an actual D&D &D bad guy. I assume he is. Uh... One, two, three. Dark Uh One, two. Mirror Trigger. Um, kind of stack all this up. So I got two copies ready to go. And it would be sack a creature, return an artifact, or sack an artifact, return a... Uh, card. Um... They're not artifacts. They can do each other. All right. One tap. Sack a, let's say, artifact. Um, I mean, theoretically, I can grab it, which is not another. Um, I could sack an artifact, which will be the mirror retriever, naturally, mm -hmm. uh, which will give me an artifact from my graveyard to my hand. So probably the iron mirror. Because amount of times that I don't. sack a creature to return them. Yeah, but when Mirror Trigger dies, artifact card. Oh, duh. Yeah. Duh. Um, yeah, so I'm going to copy Trading Post with both of these boys to draw mm -hmm. two cards. Uh, Mirror Trigger dies, I'll get this artifact from my graveyard to my hand, and I will draw two cards. Three. Because you draw one for yep, it. Yep, one for it, one yeah. One for each copy. One for the usual, yep. All right. <sighs> I think I played an island, right? Yeah, that sounds right. Okay. Say go. Yeah, old Gunnar Bones, villainous web already. Yeah. He's ridiculous. Uh, I lose a life and draw an additional card for the Phyrexian Arena. Go 34. Hey, join me down here at 34. Mm. Uh, Cabal Stronghold. Like, fine, I guess. Uh, how many swamps? One, two, three, four, five. And I think five is when it Man, you know, actually produces me an additional one. If I want to be trading posting artifacts back, then maybe I do want Psy. No. Oh. All right, so we'll sack the three treasures to float five mana off this, the Cabal Stronghold. For a Soul Foundry with a mana floating. And an Urkana Revenant on it. For I would like my things to tap for a fuck ton of mana instead of just the ones that it does. That's cool. Uh, and then in case you have any ideas of killing my old Gnawbone, 
<laughs> okay. Play a Mimic Bat so I can get it back. I do have ideas of killing your Mimic Bat. Oh, I'll put my Mimic Bat. <laughs> uh, and then move to combat. Okay. Uh, swing for 10. 13. 13, yep. Is there really 10 or more treasures you win the game? If you have villain as well? Uh, oh, with the uh, Revel and Riches? Revel and Riches. Yeah, yeah, during your upkeep, if you have 10 or more treasures you win. 10. But they're, nothing. They're not in the same deck anymore. They should be. That, that's a win just sitting on the table. No. Anyways, so 13 treasures. I get 13 treasures and 13 squirrels. <laughs> And it's Adrian. Okay. Cool. Seat of the Synod. Now what I need to do is make my old Gnawbone a squirrel. So that you can't exile it. So that I can't exile it? What? Mm -hmm. Because exiling it wouldn't put it on the mimic bat. How would that stop me from exiling it? He has Revel and Riches and Mechanized Production in his Pirate Grixis. That's some wind cons. I always spend my charges too fast, though. Yeah, fair enough. I never learned the, like, guild names. I hate those. Um, and Riches and Mechanized Production by Pirate Grixis. Grixis is red, black, blue. Who do you run for a commander? Is it Brass? It's probably Brass. Oh, because I can sacrifice X squirrels to give target guy plus X minus X. Oh, okay. If so if exile, I try to, you I just sacrifice, sacrifice first. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. All right. bait. I want a mimic bat. Ken has... Shattering Pulse. No mimic bat. Respond. <laughs> You can also have no mimic that. Fair, but can we say that I also bought back the? Yeah. Okay. Yep. For sure. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> well, if I can't, if I can't have one, you cannot have one. Uh, cruising group destroy. Yeah. Okay. Can't respond with trading post. Yeah. How do you like that? The, the brass, I mean. Has it been has it been fun? Is that the one that like steals one, a guy when two. you attack? Iron Mirror. Um because I've always been curious, there was like the two there's the red and blue guy that came out in Commander Legends that like whenever a guy you control attacks you get a treasure, and then whenever a pirate hits you like exile the top card of their library and they get a treasure or something like that. Uh, oh, I should play that in one tap, pay a life, all the goat. How long has it been? I don't remember. Have I ever had a goat? Oh, if three pirates hit a player, you steal a permanent. That's fucked. Well, that's probably really good with a mask wood. Yeah, yeah that's pretty good. <laughs> so um, all of your guys are pirates. And you're in black, so you can just go tutor it. And you're in blue, so you can just go tutor it. He's new, he can't tap. Um, 13 1 1 squirrels. They're all squirrels. Okay. Say go. I got 20 life. I sack six of my treasures. There's no. And go down to four treasures remaining to get an Arcana Revenant. Nice. Which gets me a squirrel. And this is going to go up to 17 during my turn. Two squirrels. I should have a copy right here of an Arcana Revenant. Now my swamps tap for an additional black. Let me tell you how I don't really need mana. <laughs> Just like pirates in general. Yeah, I want to make a pirate travel. I also want to make travel all the time. After you open the Commander Legends box. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like one of my 10 million pirate cutlasses, which suck? Or no, the other cutlass. Ah, pirate cutlass I think is good. Um, it's a Moss War Bridge. Enters play tapped. I look at the top four. Exile. Are you just going to chill next to each other? <laughs> the exact same fucking thing. But, let's talk about how strong that thing is on a gnawbone. Mm. <laughs> okay. 
and make another one as it attacks. Uh, and then I move to combat and Might swing well. for a bunch. 10 and 17 is 27. Uh, 27? Okay. I have three blockers, but 20 life. Fair enough. Let me tell you how much Arkham Dagson needed to get my Microsynth mm-hmm. and how I need haste for this boy. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Yeah. And yeah, you were like, I make so many treasures. And I'm like, oh, if I can just connect. Oh. Yes. <laughs> yes. No, my Skyclave relics. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I can I can sack the treasures in response, but... Yeah. The Skyclave relics. They're going. Yeah. Was it like, oh, we got this Hellkai Tyrant. We needed him to steal something thematically appropriate. Let's have all treasures. Yeah. And clues. Yeah. Because he's a investigator. Yeah. <laughs> I did like someone was like, oh, you added the dog type. And there's investigate. Can we have a Blues Clues dog? There's a dog called Floodhound. So, there you go. Done. Done <laughs> and done. Does he, does he make clues? Hey! Oh! It's like free to blue cap investigate. Oh, okay. That's cool. 